Hi and welcome back to a brand new video here of me talking about the uh, Panorama SCS12 again, the Nectar. And uh, I want to look into how to map plugins, right? Now, you can use the Nectarine, which is quite complicated. Uh, there's going to be an update where it's going to be uh, better integrated. So I'm not going to go into that yet because I find this useful enough, basically. So if I go to my vocal bus, I have a SSL right um ssl coming up ssl vocal strip here okay let's put this in the corner out the way so we can see it now as you can see there's these knobs here for the eq the plosar dsr and the uh, compounder now these are kind of randomly spread across here and none of these uh, buttons here are used. So, and none of the colors are mapped out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna unmap everything and then just remap it all these in order. So like this will be like taking up one section. This takes, uh, this would take up another section here. And, uh, and I'll do the colors according to what's on here. And then I will do these buttons as well. So I'm going to do one or two to show you how that works and then speed up the process because otherwise it's going to take some time. But once you've got the idea of how it all works, so first of all, you've got to shift and turn on learn mode, right? Now, then you've got a data button. You've got these functions here, clear all, clear one. I'm going to clear them all, right? There you go, clear all. And uh, now, learn, now it is completely, that's it, that's gone. And then I'm going to, First of all, assign this attack here. I'll assign that up the top. So compound attack, uh, compound ratio, compound ratio, compound release here. Yeah, and then compound on off. I'm going to do it down here, down here. There you go, compound on off working perfectly and then we got these softeny and drive here which i think i'll use here because i will be using that more probably than the diploser and that over there so i'll do the softeny on off softeny on off okay that's good, and this comes on when you see that. And then the drive, important drive, I'll do that as well. Then I've got these two buttons here, the threshold, I'll put up here, the threshold here, here. and the uh, ex expo, exp ex whatever it is, threshold uh, there, and then the makeup gain here. Okay, and I'll put them all the same colors. So then we have that in one section, all here in one color. So I then go to shift here, set color. Okay, and then um, I'm gonna do that, the green color that's there. Okay, green, green. I will do these gray as well, so green green and then I've got a compound release green as well uh, green and these two here which is the compound uh, threshold I'm going to do gray like a gray color I've got gray that's black that's pretty cool black I'll do that black and the compound the X do that black as well. Black, and then I'll do the main one. No, I'll do them white. Hold up, I'll do them white. Do them white. So go back to white. White, and this one I'll do black, which kind of looks the same. Uh, I must admit, with black. Black, 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 black. There you go, black. So I've got that section done. So that's the uh, those knobs there are done, and these are done here, which is uh, 
which is cool. So now I can turn off mode off and I'll continue on doing the rest of the the rest of the stuff. Uh, and uh, I'll be back in a bit. So as you can see, I've uh, now done all, I mapped out all my, um, if I go to the B, you can see I've done this that corresponds to, these basically are equalizer on, off. These buttons here turn, are turning off functions, on and off functions here. And then I did like the, um, here and here, no, here and here, yeah, here and here. This one needs to come off. I'll take that off. That doesn't need to be there. So these ones here are red, are uh, blue. These are the, the red ones. And then if we go at the top, we've got the output and we've got the input, which I've done as uh, these white colors here, kind of white colors. And uh, then this one here is the uh, black. This is a black color, uh, meant to be. And then in the middle, I, on page A, I have the compounder, which is uh, the first one, the commander here is green, as you can see. Then the threshold to the uh, the expander threshold and that, these buttons are here. Let me switch it on and off here, as you can see. And at the bottom, I've got all these here programmed as well, which is great. So cool. But anyway, uh, so I've mapped this out to sort of like keeping things together. And um, then I know what's what. So they have the uh, the layout there. Uh, it's pretty easy to do, actually. And I think uh, if you can add pages to uh, with the next arena and then have like as many pages as you want. But I think that might become a bit overwhelming. I think... All the 24 knobs is really good, plus these. So that's 24 knobs plus uh, eight. That gives you 32 controllers of a plugin without having to use Nexurin, which is really cool. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Ciao.